trying to make it happen. So this ladder um, came from J.C. Penney's. J.C. Penney's was uh, closing their store back in September, and they were selling everything, all the fixtures, um, all the everything. So they had this ladder in the stock room, and they sold it. And Stephen's like, yeah, I could really use that. And we've put it to good use. We have put this ladder to good use for all kinds of things. I just wanted to see if this would rub out of here because, you know, it was all oxidized in on the top half of the truck. The lower half is, this truck's been resprayed and it looks like they sprayed it out in the weeds somewhere where it was raining when they were spraying it because it's got a lot of bubbles and stuff in it so it wasn't a very good job whoever painted it but um the lower half yeah that's no good at all that's you can see the finish is coming off of it and so this was all oxidized over up here and i wanted to see what it would look like now i'm getting a good view of it getting it rubbed out See what we're working with. Uh oh, still see squirrels there. Well, the truck kind of matches the clouds. Black, cloudy day, dark rain clouds. Sets the backdrop for a black truck. Let's see what it's looking like. Yeah, that's definitely better. See how it's faded by on that back wing there? Oh my goodness, I can see the difference. See, that's called oxidation. Now what's that silver spot? That's just a bad spot in the paint where it peeled off. But was that there when you bought it? Yes, it was. There's nothing I can do about that. Paint a peace sign on it, I guess. Oh, I can see the difference. Oh, I sure can. So yeah. Watch it. You know, when you wax, you want to do it on a cloudy day, so this is a perfect day. Oh, why is that? Because, especially with black paint, you don't want any kind of heat while you're waxing. If it dries on there, you may not get it off. So, so a cloudy day is the best day to do it? Yep, cloudy day is the day to do it if you're going to do it. So I just wanted to see if it would uh, buff out. Look better. Nothing I can do about the side. Sand it down and repaint it, I guess. Well, it certainly looks shinier. Yeah, look at the other side in comparison. See? see the, you can see the clouds in that. Yeah, you can. You can see the reflection of the clouds. Can't see a deadly spot in that. See, that's what I was. See how it's all oxidized over? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I do see the difference. Yep. So, I thought I'd give it a try. I really don't want to spend too much time on it. You have to have, remember that one time when I waxed the top of the Volvo? Yeah. I had to tie a rope around me. <laughs> yeah, I do remember I tied that. it onto the chassis. Yeah. Yeah, that's what you have to do or you'll just slide right, especially when you get the wax on, you'll just slide right off. 
I, I do remember that. I remember you had a rope. Of course, I was 15 years younger back then, too. I do remember you had a rope tied on you. I sure do. See, there's your tag on the side of it where you paid for it. Uh-oh. Getting some rocking action. Don't want rocking action. There's some against the truck. That's better. Yeah, get this piece here. Ugh. <sighs>